ਗੁਰੂ ਅੰਗਦ ਦੇਵ ਜੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਅਮਰਦਾਸ ਜੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਰਾਮਦਾਸ ਜੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਅਰਜਨ ਦੇਵ ਜੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਹਰਗੋਬਿੰਦ ਜੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਹਰਰਾਏ ਜੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਹਰਕ੍ਰਿਸ਼ਨ ਜੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਤੇਗ ਬਹਾਦਰ ਜੀ ਐਂਡ ਗੁਰੂ ਗੋਬਿੰਦ ਸਿੰਘ ਓਵਰ 10 ਗੁਰੂਸ ਓਕੇ so our gurus during their lives they undertook long tours to preach their religion to tell the people what is the right path if we want to live good lives on this earth and uh, what is the right course uh, through which we can be in tune with the akal purakh vahi so this is the focus of the teaching of our guru after guru gobind singh ji our guru is guru granth sahib theek hai in guru granth sahib we have teachings of first five gurus and then ninth guru guru tegh bahadur ji the bani of total six six guru five first gurus and then ninth guru guru tegh bahadur and uh, there are some other saints from different religion there are uh, muslim also there are hindus also their teachings are also uh, contained in this granth guru granth sahib ji because all these teachings the teachings of the gurus and teachings of all those saints confirm to the basic truth of life that is why Uh, uh, these are included in this grant and guru guru arjan dev ji the fifth guru compiled this grant he had a mission to create a grant to create a forum where all the religions could unite so the message of uh, guru granth sahib is universal brotherhood all religions all the people living in different parts of the world all are brothers this is the basic uh, message of shri guru granth sahib so after these uh, shri guru granth sahib ji we have some more banis which we read or recite in, uh, uh, in our guru can you tell me what is that bani no this is bani of guru granth sahib apart from guru granth sahib ji we have some other banis also which can be recited in our gurudwaras in any uh, sikh ceremony can you tell me what are sikh banis but these are banis of guru granth sahib and uh, apart from this we have some bani written by gurudas ji by gurudas ji he was this scribe who wrote first bida of shri guru granth sahib ji guru arjan dev ji uh, assigned him the work of writing the first bida of guru granth sahib and pai gurdas wrote some banis himself also the, those banis are not included in guru granth sahib so bani of pai gurdas ji we always uh, uh, recite that uh, satguru nanak pargitya mitti tund jag janan hua that is written by pai gurdas <laughs> but that is not in guru granth sahib so pai gurdas is equally important for the six and then after pai gurdas then there is one more pai gurdas singh who wrote one more word one more bani uh, which we generally read at the time uh, when we celebrate the gurpurb of guru gobind singh wah wah guru gobind singh ape chhor chela that pai gurdas singh uh, 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 was uh, after guru gobind singh ji first pai gurdas was when guru arjan dev ji was uh, compiling the guru granth sahib and second pai gurdas who wrote this war wah wah guru gobind singh ape guru chela he came after guru gobind singh and he wrote this uh, war a form of poetry in punjabi so in which he he, he, he uh, wrote some 
40 stanzas uh, regarding Guru Gobind Singh and the six after Guru Gobind Singh. So there are two Pai. First is Pai Gurdas, second is Pai Gurdas Singh. Okay? And then there is one Pai Nandalalji. Pai Nandalalji was a poet at the court of Guru Gobind Singh. At the court of Guru Gobind Singh. He was a great Persian scholar. He wrote in Persian, he wrote in Punjabi, and his poetry, his body is also equally respected in our Gurdwaras. So, whenever uh, you might have uh, uh, heard or sung uh, 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 Badshah Darvesh Guru Gobind Singh, Hak Hak Andesh Guru Gobind Singh, at, at the, uh, the Gurdwaras of uh, uh, Guru Gobind Singh Ji. So those Persian bodies are written by Pai, Pai Nandalaj. So Guru Sahib and other saints whose body is included in Guru Granth Sahib Ji. After that, Pai Gurdas Ji, Pai Gurdas Singh Ji, and Pai Nandalaj. Uh, can you uh, tell me? Any one Shabad written by Guru Gobind Singh, Bani of Guru Gobind Singh is not included in uh, Granth Sahib, Guru Granth Sahib. That Bani is also outside Guru Granth Sahib. So, when we talk of Bani, singing of Bani in our Gurdwaras, we sing the Bani of Guru Granth Sahib Ji, then Bani of Guru Gobind Singh Ji, which is wow. in Tasan Gran, the okay. uh, Granth of the Tenth Guru. Then Pai Gurdas Ji, Pai Gurdas Singh Ji, and Pai Nandraj. How many? Pai Gurdas Ji. Pai Gurdas, two Pai Gurdas, then Pai Nandra, Guru Gobind Singh Ji, and then Bani of Guru Gurdas Singh Ji. This is all the Bani which is sick and recite in a Guru Okay. Uh, can you tell me any one Shabad by Guru Gobind Singh Ji, uh, which he wrote and we sing in the Guru By Guru Gobind Singh. That whatever they've done for us, whatever has happened, whatever has happened. Let's take a guess. That is written by Pai Gurdas. You just sang the Shabad. They show up or more here. Oh, it is written by Guru Gobind Singh. I'm singing another word. Huh? Uh, I'm trying to think about it. Other Shabbat. Mitra Piyare Muhal Muri Tanaka. You have heard that Shabbat so many times and uh, you have sung also. That is written by Guru Gobind Singh Ji. That is, that is not in Guru Granth Sahib. Okay? So, uh, what I mean to say, we should always remember that our Guru is Guru Granth Sahib. The Bani included in Guru Granth Sahib Ji is our Guru. And apart from this Bani, the Bani which has approval to be sung in the Gurdwara in the Sikh household is by Pai Gurdas Ji, Pai Gurdas Singh Ji, Guru Gobind Singh Ji, and Pandit Pai Nandaraj. Okay? Uh, who was the poet who wrote in Persian? Pai Nandalal Ji. Pai Nandalal Ji wrote in Persian. He was a poet at the court of Guru Gobind Singh Ji at Anandpur Sahib. You know how many poets were with Guru Gobind Singh Ji in Anandpur Sahib? In the court of Guru Gobind Singh Ji? Guru Gobind Singh Ji in Anandpur Sahib and at Ponta Sahib also okay. so had 52 poets uh, in his court. Okay? 52 okay. poets okay. in his court. Okay. And uh, whenever Guruji found the time, they will sit together, uh, the poets will uh, uh, relate the, narrate the poetry, whatever they have written in the praise of Guru, in the praise of uh, Akal Purukh, Vahiguru, or whatever the Sikh uh, ideals 
so all those 52 poets were uh, at the at the court of Guru Gobind Singh Ji, and Guru Gobind Singh Ji was their leader. Uh, so Guru Gobind Singh Ji was a great poet himself. So he wrote so many uh, things, so many bani's. Can you tell me any other bani which is written by Guru Gobind Singh Ji, uh, which is uh, 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 included in our litany? Jab Sahib. Jab Sahib is written by Guru Gobind Singh Ji. How many banis? Uh, uh, how many banis are there in uh, uh, our uh, daily nitni? Five. Three in the morning. Three in the morning. Two in the evening. One at the sunset and at, uh, one at uh, bedtime. We have total five. So, what are the morning prayers? Morning banis? Japji Sahib is written by Guru Nanak Dev Ji. Jab Sahib is written by Guru Gobind Singh. And Swaye is written by Guru Gobind Singh. In the morning prayer, in the morning nithne, we have one Bani by Guru Nanak Dev Ji. And that is from Guru Granth Sahib. That is Japji Sahib. And other two Banis. One is Jab Sahib. Jab Sahib is not in Guru Granth Sahib. That is in the Dasan Granth, which is written by Guru Gobind Singh. That is the first body of that Granth. Jab Sahib. And second body is also from that Granth. Swaye. Ten Swaye. Ten short poems, short shabas known as Swaye. That is also written by Guru so in the morning prayer, we read one Bani of Guru Nanak Dev Ji, one Bani from Guru Granth Sahib Ji, and two Banis of Guru Granth Sahib Ji, Dasam Granth, Guru Gobind Singh Ji. Theek hai? Theek hai? Now you will remember, ke what are the Banis written by Guru Gobind Singh Ji, which are in our morning prayer? Jab Sahib, Sri. Jab Sahib and Soya. And when? Amrit ceremony is done. You know what is Amrit? Yes. Amrit Guru Sahib gave Amrit to the Sikhs when he created Khalsa at Anandpur Sahib in the year 1699 on Basaki day. And Banis were read at that time. These Swayas are read are recited at the time of uh, preparing Amrit. Das Suvayya. That is why these are called Sudha Suvayya. Sudha means Amrit. Take it. Otherwise it is Suvayya. Suvayya Shri Mokhwak. Shri Mokhwak means written by the Guru. Guru's own uh, Bani Shri Mokhwak. Because these are read at the time of Amrit ceremony. These are known as Amrit Swaye or Sudha Swaye. Okay, Sudha Swaye. We will be doing all these Swayas later on. And in the evening, at the sunset, we do Rehras. Rehras. What is the full name of Rehras? Sodar Rehras. Sodar Rehras. Sodar Rehras. In Sodar Rehras, we have Shabbats from different Guru Sahib. There are some Shabbats by Guru Nanak Dev Ji, Fourth Guru, Guru Ram Das Ji, Guru Arjan Dev Ji, Shabbats by different Gurus. Okay? And then there is Chaupi in the Rairas, Hamri Karo, Adir Achya, that part, that Chaupi is written by who wrote the Syaup Chaupi? That is also written by Guru Gobind Singh. And after Chaupai, there is one Soya. That is also written by Guru Gobind Singh. Pahin gai jaste tumre. Tab te kum aam kare niya. Similarly, we have Anand Sahib short five bodies. And one last body of Anand Sahib that is done at the time of Rehras. 
that is anand sahib is written by guru amar das third so reh ras is a compilation uh, of uh, uh, shabas written by various guru ji but at the time of uh, guru nanak dev ji at the time of guru nanak dev ji only one shabad was recited at the time of uh, sunset and that was sodar raag asa mahalla pehla from where our red rasa starts only sodar was was read came like under them the rest of the banis were added later on by guru arjan dev when he compiled the grand so red rasa became bigger that is why it is known as sodar red rasa because it started with only one shabad that of sodar later on guru arjan dev ji added more shabad to uh, this and later on guru gobind singh ji added chopi to this and then soya to this and uh, bani of guru uh, third guru uh, anand is also uh, added by guru arjan dev ji the fifth guru when he compiled the guru ras so this is our raras first bani in the evening at the time of sunset generally we uh, we say no we do read us any time in the evening sometimes when we are sleeping we are doing read us but uh, according to sick code of conduct it should be done at the time of sunset while the sun is getting down the sick starts reciting so that they are okay and when sick goes to sleep before sleeping he will do sohila sohila means a song song and uh, uh, we call it kirtan sohila also yes. why we call it kirtan sohila will, will anybody tell me the name of the bani is sohila 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 means a song because it was generally sung by the ragis and kirtan was done of this bani the uh, shabas so it came to be known as kirtan sohila otherwise the name of the bani is sohila so it has bani by uh, shabad by guru nanak dev ji guru ram das ji and guru arjan dev ji do you know where it is here uh, will you tell me which is the shabad uh, you do kirtan sohila hmm? will you tell me which is the shabad uh, written by uh, guru arjan dev ji in this in this sohila Guru Arjan Dev, the fifth one. It's the last part, right? Ah, last one. Yeah. How did you come to know? I read it before. It's like Asamila Panjwa. Panjwa, Shabash, Guru. Hey, Raag Gauri Purbi Mahala Panjwa. Karo Bhanti Sono Mere Mita Sant Tehel Ki Bhi. It is written by the fifth Guru, Kam Mahala Panjwa. And the Shabad, uh, preceding the Shabad, is राग गौड़ी पूर्वी महला चौथा काम क्रोध नगर भाव करया बरसात ऊ खंडल खंडा है हु रोट दिस गुरु राम दास एंड बिफोर दिस वी हैव आरती दैट इज आल्सो डन आरती दिस शब्द ऑफ आरती गगन में था और आप जानते हैं हु रोट दिस राग तलासी महला पर गुरु नानक देव एक किस तरह शुरू होती है गगन में थार रब चांदी पकमे तार का मंडल जंत मोती तोप वाले आलोपम जबरो कर एंड शब्द बिफोर दिस शब्द आल्सो और आल्सो रिटन बाय गुरु सो बेटे ਆਪਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਸਭ ਤੋਂ ਬੇਸਿਕ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਥਿੰਗ ਬੇਸਿਕ ਨੋਲੇਜ ਆ ਸਿੱਖ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਐਵਰੀ ਸਿੱਖ ਸ਼ੁਡ ਨੋ ਥਿਸ ਵਾਟ ਆਰ ਦੀ ਬਾਨੀਸ ਵਿਚ ਹੀ ਹੈਸ ਹੀ ਸਪੋਜ਼ ਟੂ ਸਨ ਆਫ ਵਾਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦੀ ਨਿਤਨੇਮ ਵਾਟ ਆਰ ਆਵਰ ਡੇਲੀ ਪ੍ਰੇਅਰ ਵਾਟ ਆਰ ਦੀ ਪ੍ਰੇਅਰਸ ਆਫ ਦੀ ਮਾਰਨਿੰਗ ਵਾਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦੀ ਪ੍ਰੇਅਰ ਆਫ ਦੀ ਈਵਨਿੰਗ ਵਾਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦੀ ਪ੍ਰੇਅਰ ਆਫ ਦੀ ਬੈਟਰ ਐਂਡ 
then overall who are the uh, our gurus and who are the guru sikhs whose bani is, can be recited in the gurdwara so today we have tried to understand all these uh, basic things uh, can we repeat uh, our uh, uh, the bani of the uh, uh, guru sahib uh, who wrote for guru granth sahib ji and what is what are the bani outside guru granth sahib ji which can be recited in our gurdwara what what are the bani in guru granth sahib ji written by you? how many gurus Six. Six gurus. Can you name them? Kriyod, Nanak Dev Ji, Shabash, Angad Dev Ji, Amradas Ji, Ramdas Ji, Arjun Dev Ji. Guru, Shri Guru Arjun Dev Ji. Shri Guru Arjun Dev Ji. Shri Arjun Dev Ji and Shri Guru Tegh Bahadur. Shabash, very good. So six gurus, Bani is included in Guru Granth Sahib. And outside Guru Granth Sahib Ji. Who are the people who wrote Bani? Shri Gurdas. Pai Gurdas. Pai Gurdas. Shri Pai Gurdas. Pai Gurdas. Pai Gurdas Singh. Shri Shabash. Guru Gobind Singh. Pai Nanda. Pai Nanda. Pai Nanda. So when we talk of Bani outside uh, Guru Granth Sahib Ji, we will first uh, name Guru Gobind Singh. First, take the name of Guru Gobind Singh. Though Pai Gurdas came earlier, he was at the time of uh, uh, Guru Arjun Dev Ji. He was the scribe of Guru Granth Sahib Ji, the first leader of Guru Granth Sahib Ji. Though Guru Pai Gurdas was in the uh, 17th century, and Guru Gobind Singh Ji came later on, but he is our Guru. Pai Gurdas is not a Guru. So, whenever we talk of the Bani by various people, we say outside Guru Granth Sahib Ji, the Bani which a Sikh can recite, can be recited in the Sikh Gurdwara, that is by Guru Gobind Singh Ji, Pai Gurdas Ji, Pai Gurdas Singh Ji, and Pai Gurdas. Okay? Koi Shabbat Pano Asa Yad Hega? Guru Gobind Singh Ji, the Bani Pano Yad. याद है जबानी के लिए हैं उसी होने पड़े हैं सिगर वे शिवा पर मुझे जबानी याद है कि नहीं याद है तो सुनो देशिवा पर मोहे हैं शुभ कर्मन ते कबू ना तरो दे शिवा चलो पढ़ा के पढ़ो दे हे शिवा पर मोहे इह पढ़ो दे हे शिवा पर मोहे इह पढ़ो शुभ कर्मन ते कब शुभ कर्मन ते कब हूँ न डरो न डरो अरसियो जब जाए लरो निश्चय कर अपने जीत मरो और सिख हो अपने ही मार को इह लाल चमन को उतरो जब आप किया और दिलाल मरे आते ही रानू में तब चूर्ण तो बच्चों और कम आंटी जी कुछ ओके आउट आउट ट्रिक आउट ट्रिक अच्छा बच्चे ऐसी एक नो पढ़े वास्ते ये बनाया क्विज कंपटीशन क्विज कंपटीशन फॉर द सीनियर स्टूडेंट्स सीनियर पार्टिसिपेंट्स ठीक है आई विल गिव यू द कॉपीज दिस इज फ्रॉम टू सेक हिस्ट्री क्विज कंपटीशन Okay. Uh, what is that? You will not join the competition. Yes. Quiz competition. Hey, to see, chart ka na card hai. Dekhiyo na. Many folders are going to be ready. Then you keep them in your folders. Hey, फिर इधर तो अपन कोड़ा competition करावांगे. Everybody got it? I think uh, most of the things you already know.